Hello, traders. Because if any coming to you from the closingprint.com, Sunday the 8th, to discuss the buying that we saw off of a bad non farm payrolls number and a market reversal fueled by a gamma squeeze. With the number of stocks below their 50 day moving average hitting extreme levels, we saw institutions buying and sectors improving throughout the day. S&P 500 dipped early last week, reversing on Friday. A gamma squeeze kicking in. We had many sectors oversold. Stochastics turning. With a number of stocks trading below their 50-day moving average at an extreme level. And reversing to end Friday with nearly 20% of stocks back above their 50-day moving average. Having hit 92% below the 50-day to start the week with price action regaining the 4,300 level as puts monetized on Friday, sending the markets higher and shorts scrambling. And earlier in the week, we mentioned that the New York FANG index, the top 10 tech stocks that we follow, were rising and not moving back down to this lower trend line of this channel, congregated right around 236 Fibonacci, and we finished up the day with RSI rising and price with a nice bullish move, stochastics and MACD turning, setting up a potential follow-through to start Monday-Tuesday trading. Therefore, if we do see these stocks moving higher, we wouldn't be surprised to see the performance continue to beat the S&P 500 and the NASDAQ going into year end. The key remains the yields very strong. We did have a little reversal on Friday, a shooting star, but still bullish with junk bonds regaining some lost ground. We'd need to see junk bonds move a bit higher and the 10 year move a bit lower along with high-yield corporate debt, as S&P 500 remains above 4,300, a key level to start the week. So if yields can manage a descent, we could see the dollar continue lower as well. That began Wednesday with a reversal and continued lower into Thursday and Friday. Exactly what we need to see if you're looking at these tech leaders going into Monday and Tuesday. We'd like to see the dollar and the 10 year dropping lower and junk bonds, high yield corporate, biotechs, and small cap IWM all turning higher to start the week. Bitcoin has been rising, so that's another risky asset we'd like to see following through. And advanced decline is starting its turn. In addition to commodities pulling back, Brent and West Texas crude dropping back towards longer term moving averages together with gasoline dropping off last week. The markets are setting up for a October reversal at the Friday's bounce as we look for a green light to start the week. Of particular importance, I'd like to see the number of stocks trading by their fifth today starting to gain ground and following through with a trigger on CCI about to develop and the number of stocks above their 200 day. If we can get these three to start turning with the 10 year and the dollar dropping off, we should see money flow confirmation early on Monday. Starting off this week, we have quite a few IBD 50 names that are set up and ready to follow through. Personally, I'm looking for a Lilly and Novo Nordisk to follow through. We had a couple of new names also added to the IBD. And we saw Meta, NVIDIA, and Tesla added to this top 50 list for the week. Also ran a scan of stocks that were oversold. Stochastics turning more bullish. With Swing Trader emphasizing Meta and Palo Alto Networks, we also saw quite a few cybersecurity names like CrowdStrike and Zscaler. Both of which started following through along with the cyber ETF. 
which started showing strength in the group early on Thursday, closing higher in the upper half of its daily range than following through after a dip on Friday. This ETF following cybersecurity is set up, looking for stochastics and MACD to follow through and volume to pick up. In addition, Lilly and Novo Nordisk turned some heads last week with a lot of positive press about obesity, drugs, with Lilly showing a stochastics turn in MACD. This is still looking good for a follow through on Monday and Tuesday, so we might take a position there if you haven't already done so. With Novo Nordisk also bouncing, looking for a follow through, MACD and stochastics turning volume picked up on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday showing that institutions have started accumulating shares after this little pullback, RSI is rising and back above 50. Some of the financials like Arch Capital follow through with stochastics turning. In addition, Kinsale Capital is back on the list. This one's looking pretty strong as well, breaking higher. Stochastics turning, volume picking up. Big Cap Tech, Meta and Nvidia also on the list this week, looking for a follow through. With Meta having a very strong day on Friday and NVIDIA following through pushing back above its 50-day moving average. While many of the chip stocks and AI-related names like Supermicro turned, moved back above the 50-day on Monday, dipped and then followed through Thursday, Friday. Looking for a push higher as well. Tesla is also set up pretty nice. Looks like it's going to follow through. We made a big deal out of it moving back above its 50-day on Wednesday. Following through, stochastics rising, MACD crossing. This is looking much better. Looking for a, an attack of that 280 level. Additional stocks from a scan that looks for setups that have stochastics oversold and turning. Looking for stocks that are above their 20 and 50-day moving averages as well. With many of these set up to follow through. Just waiting on Monday to see how markets set up to resume what might have started on Friday. Looking for the bulls to return and for many of these stocks in the lower section to continue higher this week. Okay, traders, that's going to do it for me. This is because of any coming to you from theclosingprint.com. I'm going to get outside and enjoy the rest of the day. I'll send out a watch list later tonight around 12 midnight on the East Coast, around 9 o'clock on the West Coast. So be sure to check your inbox for that. Otherwise, enjoy the rest of your weekend. Take care, and we'll see you in the morning. Ciao.